Welcome back everybody, it's more everybody's golf on PlayStation 4. I found another 18 hole tournament I've not played, a regular T Tornado Cups on Balata. Not set a score, but it's got strong wind. So, easy course, custom club, strong wind, could be entertaining. We've got 8 metres per second off the first tee, crosswind. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be fun. The biggest problem here is how, how much do you allow for the wind? You know, you're going to be aiming, look at that, how we aimed well off the green. Might even hold, no, it's going to go off the back. Oh, bollocks. Never mind, 20 yard chip back. 8 metres per second wind. Tornado cups though, so in theory, yeah, I should be able to get it close. So we'll see how that all balances out. You've got the wind, you've got the tornado cups, you've got the custom clubs. We'll see. I've never set, never set a score on here for 18, but I have for 9, so we'll see how we go. I mean, you might get some sort of massive downwind tee shot to play. So again, heck of a lot of wind. Oh, that's unbelievable about that, it's moved. Anyway, so 20 yards to go again. Bit of a crosswind. It's kind of into the wind as well. But again, those sorts of shots, it doesn't matter so much. We can get the eagle. The beauty of the topspin chips is they're so low, the wind doesn't really, doesn't really do a lot. It's a four run to start, no putts. So the other way this time. Go! Master Hall. It does move it a bit, doesn't it? So a hundred and just over a hundred and one to go. Oh, nice shot. I was trying to figure out how much the wind turns that ball over. Oh, I wasn't far away. It definitely doesn't turn it over as much as you as a normal shot. But it still does have an impact. So three eagles in a row. Get us to six. Now, no, oh, a crosswind path through would be hard. This is just into the wind. So all, all we've got to do is figure out how much extra we put on to allow for the wind. That's a bit Master lower because it's a topspin shot. Yeah, I've overcooked it. Didn't need that much extra on it. But we'll get a chip. Got the birdie. It's a seven under. So five, seven and a half meters. I don't know. Maybe it's there. We I mean, have underestimated all of them so far, and they were mostly topspin. So with backspin, I have no idea how much the wind's going to move them. If you have really put them up there, just going to creep on. No, not quite. Gives me a chip. And she pops another eagle. So that's nine under. It's a par four. So another par four. Again, it's going to be round the corner. Oh, nice 
nice shot. Nice shot. Gonna land in that rough again. Yeah, but we'll get a chip. Oh, okay. That's a bit of a longer chip than last time. And we're off the bare ground, which takes a bit more of your more of your power away. Good, good. I think I've left that short. Ah! I have to take a birdie there. It's definitely an eagle on offer. Just didn't, didn't give it enough grief. That gets us to ten. Now this will be fun. So this is now an elevated. Oh, no, it's not elevated. It's four meters down. It's elevated relative to the fairway. Enormous amount of um. Action going to be needed on this. Okay, and get the top spin on it. Masterful. You know, mess with, with the accuracy. Look at the bend on that ball. Oh, just a little bit right. That moved a heck of a way in the air. I mean, I haven't had to try a backspin shot yet, but when I do, <laughs> going to be aiming for the other fairway or something. So that's 11. Oh, it's a par four. So we get another drivable par four. Ah, missed the impact. It's gone way right. The wind is only going to make that worse, but it might come back a bit. No. Ooh, stay up. Don't end up on the out of bounds. Yeah, okay, so we've got 20 yards to go. Good, good. Oh, Cup just got it. That had a bit... No, no, it flicked it out. Bit, bit too much mustard on it. Still, stopped it going miles away. So we get the birdie, not the eagle. That's 12 under. So nine's the question mark hole, and it's downhill, and it's downwind. How far can we hit this? Well, got a bit of backspin on it, so we're going to give the wind every opportunity to shift it. We'll lose the run out a little bit, but I'll take that. Is that going to be 420 odd? Yeah, that's not bad. Got my two gems. So it's approach words. I don't know, maybe there. Super hard to read these. There we go. As it's top spin, it'll Ooh. lose a lot less. Look at the line, it's coming around. Oh, not quite. Pace was good though. Don't let the eagle slip. Pace was good. Albatross would have been nice though. Nice we finished with an eagle for 14 under. It's 10, 11, 12 we always have the issues with. We'll see. The wind is not going to make my case any better, is it? But, you know, you can't do more than 14. Tornado cups are ridiculous. So, 10. Again, we've got the crosswind. I mean, it's going to have to pitch in the rough. There's no way to get enough angle on it. Just need to bounce it over the sand. There you go. That's all right, I'll take that. And just run it in. It's a good start with the eagle. So that's 16, 11's next, par 4. This one's got that, um... Oh, 11. It's a par four. Yeah, so we've got to thread the needle here, so we've got to be actually quite precise. Yeah, okay. Maybe there. Oh, nice shot. No, nowhere near. Nowhere near. Oof. So we're in the bunker. That was a... 
massive misread. That's the way to put that. Can we get it close? Oh, we can get it in. So it didn't matter in the end. We missed the fairway, but we produced a bit of a, a nice bunker shot. It's 18 under. 12's that big downhill par 3. I've never done well on this one. So it's 7 yards downhill. There's a massive amount of wind on it. I'm going to have to play it backspin. I mean, you know, anywhere close is nice. Nope, sand. Long. Line was pretty decent, though. Yeah, we got it. So if you pitch it in the right area, the cup will take care of you. So we take the birdie there. 13 to the par 5. So this is straighter than it looks. However... Should get more gems for getting it to nearly to 400. Not bad. I suppose you get points, don't you? Right. So, a little bit over 60 to go. It's a bit uphill. Again, gotta read the distance, gotta read the wind. Ah, yeah, just skipped on too much. I suppose it was downwind. We're still getting eagle. Just not getting these albatrosses today. I guess it's a 21. There's a couple of par fours coming up. Oh, 14. It's a par four. A 14 is usually drivable. Again, we might have to go backspin here just to get the thing to hold. Backspin onwards. Yeah. Oh, caught the front edge. Killed it. <sighs> Nightmare. Okay, so backspin approach wedge in. Actually, it's only seven yards. Wind will turn it over. That's well, okay. Did you get this for the par? Oh, we're going to have a par on this card. It's a 21 under still. But that was a mistake. Clipping that front edge was not, not what we needed to do. So we've got another downwind one. We'll probably go three wood here. Oh, neat shot. Ooh, got a little bit lucky there. But you know, you take all the luck. Put it in a hole. A bit like that. It's 23 under. Three holes to go. Comfortably leading the tournament. Now, 16. This is going to be a tricky par three. This is going to be tricky. Yeah. Not even bothered with the super side spin, I'm just trying to get it close. Oh, that'll do. That'll do. Might even come off the edge a little bit, but I'm not bothered. It's close. That's all that really matters. In she goes. 24 under. 
It's a par four, par five to finish it off. It's a par four. It's a 17 right into the teeth of the gale. Got the top spin on it. Usually doesn't have enough to run up the hill at the club power I've got, yeah, especially into that wind. But we get a chip. This will be a bit of a skidder. Good, good. Oh, just outside the cup's range. Line was good, just too much pace. So we're gonna have to take the birdie. That'll be 25. I mean, for sure you can get 30 under on this. If you don't make stupid errors. It's 18. Oh, no, can I just hit this full chat? The wind. Alright, let's go full chat three wood. The wind really gets hold of that. Got me two gems. So, 135, sorry, left. Nine iron. Plenty of room to run it if I want to. It's a little bit elevated, it's a little bit into the wind. Didn't get the top spin I wanted. Should be close ish. Yeah, gonna be a bit shy. It's gonna be, what, five foot? Yeah, that's alright. Oh, for the eagle. I mean, it could have gone for the albatross, but you know, wasn't my day for albatrosses. So it's going to be 27 under. We made something of a mockery of that course. Ten eagles is not bad. So if you want to score heavily, this is the setup to play. Let's have a look at our stats. I mean, green should be good. We definitely missed a couple of fairways. Yeah, oh, I thought we'd get more greens than that. I suppose we were just chipping in, weren't we? Scrambling recoveries and what have you. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. Uh, please leave me a comment. And I'll see you next time for a bit more of your buddy's golf. Oh, that's a lovely card's going to swell, isn't it?